To address an ever-growing caseload, the Sauk County DA's office has added a second prosecutor to focus solely on sexual assaults. Sauk County was one of seven jurisdictions in the country to receive a federal grant to pay for it. Dave Delosier spoke today with the prosecutors and joins us from the newsroom. Yeah, uh, Charlotte and Eric, one of the reasons Sauk County received this grant is that they are already taking a progressive approach towards sexual assault cases. And what I mean by that is they don't simply focus on convictions. They also support the victims of these crimes. This grant will allow them to continue to do that and deal with a growing caseload. Let's see how then the assault happens and he moves away slowly. Inside the Sauk County District Attorney's Office, this is all too common an occurrence. However, the video clearly shows that he was next to our victim. Assistant District Attorney Linda Hoffman has been prosecuting sexual assault cases for more than 15 years. Now she has help. Exactly. Through a federal grant, Rick Spension was hired to prosecute sexual assault cases where the victims are adults. A six-year veteran police officer with UW-Madison, he brings a unique perspective. I think it can help me relate to the law enforcement officers. It can also help me relate to the victims, and it helps give me an, a better overall picture of the entire system. While he deals with adult cases, Linda Hoffman handles cases where the victims are children. While they work towards convictions, they also focus heavily on supporting the victims. I see a definite positive change and making uh, prosecutors and law enforcement more aware of the impact of trauma on sexual assault victims. Having two prosecutors dedicated to sexual assault cases allows them to deal with a growing caseload. They are working not just for prosecutions, but to change the way society treats the victims. I was trying to affect societal changes like pushing a huge boulder. Well, we're just pushing in one small aspect. Hopefully by us pushing, other people can also start to help. And when the entire society or community comes together and starts to push, then we can actually get it rolling and uh, make something positive happen for the victims. Now the approach that the Sauk County DA's office is taking has the full support of Hope House, a victim adv advocacy group. That grant allowed for the hiring of an additional prosecutor for sexual assault cases runs for, an for, runs for two years. The DA's office, however, is hoping that given the need that that position can be funded beyond that two-year period. Dave Delosier reporting tonight. Dave, thank you very much.